Hello, this is Greg from SharePoint Maven. And in today's video, I would like to explain you and show you how you can display the contents of a folder on a SharePoint page. Uh, so here's a scenario for you. I have this human resources communication site, all right, with a bunch of uh, web parts and different information. And on that side, I have a document library called Documents. And uh, within this library, I have a number of documents, you know, different folders. And uh, let's see, I think I have a few documents in this uh, policies folder. So what I want to do is on the main page, on the main in, you know, landing page, I want to display the contents uh, of, of this folder, just of this folder, all right? I don't need to see all the other folders I have, right? I could have a zillion of, you know, files and folders in here. Uh, I just want to display the contents of this folder on the main page, on the main landing page of HR site. So let me show you how to achieve this. So you we will need to click the edit button and add our document library. All right, so here we go. Let's add our document library. Perfect. Here's the document library where the folders reside. All right, so by default, it does display pretty much the contents of everything. So, but what you can do, we just want the contents of this folder, nothing else. Click the little pencil icon to see additional settings. And this is where you can actually specify the, you know, the folder path. All right. So if I leave it blank, it will display everything. But uh, if I do this, uh, essentially, if I type in policies, all right, and hit apply, look at this. It displays me the contents of just this folder. Now, if I had, um, you know, I my um, architecture is relatively flat. I don't have, um, you know, subfolders or anything like that. But if I did, then you would need to separate them by forward slash. Essentially, uh, type in, uh, uh, you know, something, uh, something else, uh, um, you, you know, another folder or whatever uh, you have in there. All right. Uh, but I don't, I don't have this. Uh, so it's uh, it just this one folder. That's why I only type this. But again, if you did, uh, you know, it even tells you over here for nested folders, uh, you would need to separate it by forward slash, all right? Um, in my case, again, I don't have this. So here we go. Uh, and uh, another thing I would like to do maybe, right? If I want to, do, I want to get rid of this display bar, um, you know, so uh, uh, we essentially are going to hide it. Uh, perfect, click apply. All right, and publish. Let's see what the end result is. Here we go. Look at this. You see, it automatically shows me the contents of that folder. You see, it even added uh, a name for us over here. Nice and convenient. Uh, and then here we go. Uh, just shows the contents of that particular folder, even though I obviously have many more documents in my in that document library. So that's all I wanted to show you in this particular video. Hopefully, you learned a new trick. As always, happy to see you on my blog, SharePointMaven.com as well as my YouTube channel. Thank you very much. Have a great rest of the day. Goodbye.